Some of the darkest regions in the sky aren't empty at all. They're cold, dark nebulae, and they are cold, dense clouds of gas and dust that block the light from stars behind them. Instead of glowing, they appear as dark silhouettes that are carved into the Milky Way. They're mostly made of molecular hydrogen and helium mixed with tiny, tiny dust grains. And these dust grains are so effective at absorbing light that entire star fields disappear behind them. Here are a few famous examples. First up, you have the Horsehead Nebula, which I assume you've seen. It's very famous. Then you have the Barnard 68. I hope I pronounced that right. So Barnard 68 is this isolated cloud that is so opaque, it blocks nearly all the background stars. And of course, I cannot forget about the Colsac Nebula. This is actually visible to the naked eye as this starless patch in the southern sky. Many nebulae glow because their gas is energized by nearby stars. Dark nebulae don't glow because they absorb light. But do not mistake in this darkness for emptiness, because inside these clouds there is gravity pulling together material forming protostars. Dark nebulae aren't the absence of creation, they're actually where it begins. 